here, sitting here in front of the chicken yard, and I've already been to town. I've already had my coffee. Oops, what's Judy doing over there? That leg. we got to find that leg for that bed. Anyhow, I got all the stuff for my Thanksgiving meal, so I can't wait to cook. Oh my gosh, the turkey that I got, it's just under 12 pounds, and the guy at the store told me that they're almost out of turkeys, and they're not getting any more turkeys in, so I guess I went in at a good time to get the turkey. So I'm hoping that turkey, once it's defrosted, will be able to fit maybe diagonally into the pan I got. And um, I had thought about, I had heard a method, of poaching the turkey and that is boiling the turkey and then for the last excuse me 30 minutes to hour uh, put it in the oven and roast it so I don't know I'm looking more into that I might do it I don't know we'll I'll just have to wait and see otherwise it's gonna take so long to get that thing roasted but anyhow I'm excited so today well uh, I got some cute chicken stuff to show you and I need to start working on some things for next year's garden Wow, would you look at that. Three of the leghorns are letting one of the black Asians snuggle with them. My goodness, I never thought I'd see the day. Aww, look at one of the leghorns let me hold her. She's being sweet. Sweet girl. How you doing, chicken? You are pretty happy sitting right here on my lap. Let's see if I take my arm away, if she'll fly away. Oh, shh. It's okay. I don't know. She looks pretty happy just sitting right here. You're a good chicken. Let's see, which one are you? Don't know. Okay. Look, she's still sitting on my lap. You good girl. You sweet baby. They're letting me pick them up and hold them more often, especially the rocks and the black Asians. You're a sweet girl. Look at you. You sure are pretty. Just don't poop on me. <laughs> you good girl. I wonder how long she'll sit here. We'll just have to wait and see. Remember all those logs that Mr. Lucas cut up for me that were like sopping wet? Well, I decided just to make a garden bed with them. I don't have any soil in it yet. That's okay. I'll get soil in it eventually. Uh, I'm not going to use any of this soil down by the street because it's got squash bugs in it. So yeah, the Hugo Culture method. I've got um, sticks and whatnot down the bottom. Got some leaves. And, yeah, that one was heavy. I had to roll it. Uh, I tried to actually cut some of these in half so I could make it even bigger. But um, they, they're just too wet. I mean, you put the axe down into it, and it just oozes water. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to let this work down a little bit and then put a bunch of soil in it. And then uh, hopefully have a nice garden bed for next spring. And I am going to still use this over here. It needs more, uh, it's got chicken poop in it. Hooray. Uh, it needs more soil in it. This one, I'm going to use it again too. It needs more soil in it. Um, I don't know what I'm going to plant in there. But most, a lot of the growing is going to be on this side because this is the sunny side of the house in the summer. So, I don't know. Hopefully I'll have lots and lots of raised beds here. And, of course, I'll still do my herb garden up here like this. And then I will utilize this side for garden area as well. Um, I can't remember how sunny it was during the summer back here. It's pretty sunny right now. 
um, during the winter. But uh, So yeah, we'll just have to see. I would like to have a huge garden next year. All in containers, nothing in the ground. Well, except for the raised beds. Those are kind of in the ground. <laughs> These chickens, they will roost on positively anything. <laughs> They're so sweet. Oh, what do I got behind me over here? Hi, Romeo. What you doing, pretty boy? Look at how beautiful he is. I know I keep saying that, but my goodness, he is gorgeous. Yeah, they'll get up on anything. They didn't get on those logs when they were in the coop, though. Yeah, scratch around in there, poop all you want. I don't know, I may put some stuff in there to get them to try and, I don't know, maybe scratch around and poop in there. <laughs> it's good fertilizer, I guess, from what they say. Yeah, these chickens, they're getting so big. What you doing, pretty girl? Huh? I'm going to have to start giving you guys names, putting those little tags on you. You want to come out too? You gotta go through the door. Oh, I can't wait till these are big enough to give Mr. Lucas his hens. That's gonna be an exciting day. Hi there. And if you notice the, whoops, here, hold on. The rock, the barred rocks are, and the black Asians are just as big or bigger than the leghorns. Whoa! What? Be nice! I'm sorry. Sometimes chickens get moody, especially especially leghorns. Hi there. Hi. Look how pretty, you guys. Let's see if I can get two of them real close to each other. See, they're just about the same size. Be nice, young ladies. Be nice. Whew, that wore me out, you guys. Yeah, I decided to take the logs out of the chicken yard because they really weren't getting up on them. And I can use them for a garden bed. And I think that that's going to make a mighty fine garden bed. And I can take uh, the chicken litter and whatnot from, well, from in this yard, the leaves and everything that they've, you know, pooped on. But i got to be careful because there's a lot of pine needles and they increase the acidity in the soil. So I, I don't know if I want to do that. But, uh, yeah, I think that'll make a nice garden bed, and I don't know if I could get somebody, hint, hint, Mr. Lucas, to come over with his tractor and a chain to pull some of those other logs to make some uh, garden beds out of those. That would be great, you know? Why not? Why not? I think I can do it. I tried to move one of the lo uh, big logs today, and, yeah, you can get in there. Go ahead, chicken. I gotta give these chickens some names. I have to decide which ones I'm gonna keep and... Well, I'm going to get let Mr. Lucas decide which ones he wants, and then I'll name the rest of the chickens after that. Anyhow, um, yeah, pull those logs over, make some uh, garden beds with them. And I did try and pull one of the logs off of the stack. I got it off the stack, but there's no way I can move it. I mean, um, I might be able to do it if I had some heavy-duty straps and kind of pull it and just work it around that way. Um, but no, I couldn't do that on my own, so... Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to the next spring. I think I'm going to be a little bit more ready this time. Um, I'm going to sort the water situation out much better than it was. And, well, you know what? Uh, I think I'm just going to leave it at this for today, you guys. Kind of make it a shorter one and just see what tomorrow brings. Oops, had to pick a bug off me. I thought it was a tick. Hopefully the ticks are dead for now. But anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.